Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss the following question, and the question says: Specify each of the following sets in register form. Part A: The set of letters in the word toffee. Part B: Multiples of three less than thirty. Part C: The set of consonants in the word mountain. Now, before we start solving the question, let us first recall what is register method. In register method, the elements of the set are separated. by commas and listed within braces so this is the key idea for this question and using this key idea we will solve the question let's start the solution now Part A is the set of letters in the word toffee. So in part A, we are given the word toffee. Now the distinct letters of this word are T, O, F, and E. We have to write the set of letters in the word toffee in register form. Now going back to the key idea we have in register method the elements of the set are separated by commas and listed within braces so the given set in register form is the set containing the elements t o f e since the repetition of elements is not allowed in the denotation of a set so we have written each letter only once so this is the answer for part a let's move on to part b now in part b we have multiples of 3 less than 30 so we will write all the multiples of 3 less than 30 given braces separated by commas So the given set in register form can be written as the set containing the elements three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one, twenty-four, and twenty-seven. This is the answer for part B. Part C is the set of consonants. in the word mountain so in part c we are given the word mountain let us find the consonants in this word the consonants are n n t n is repeated twice but we will consider it only once Now we will write the set of consonants in the word mountain in register form. For this, we will write the letters n and t within braces separated by commas. So the set in part C can be written in register form as the set containing the letters m, n, t. This is our answer for part C. With this we end our session hope you enjoyed the session